test. Crap. Ow! Okay, my book fell. Hold up. I'm trying to organize my room a little. Ah! Books are falling all over the place. It's a madhouse, I tell you. Okay, um... Yeah, I guess we can just go straight to Hollow Bastion with no problems. Or not. Oh wait, I forgot. I, I guess I have to fly to Neverland and then go there. Huh? Oh wait, maybe I, I have to talk to... Sit again or something, I don't know. I have to talk to somebody. I thought maybe I could just go right back there. Where is that Sid feller? Yep, that's time to sit again. Oh yeah, Ky Kyrie's in the frickin' cave. Oh yeah, I kinda forgot about all of that and just wanted to go right to Hollow Bastion. Let's go. Bro, that's all he has to say. Oh, I can take a... Oh, wait, no, this isn't a shortcut. Thought I could use this to go back to the alleyway, but... N oh, wait, no. It can, actually, because... Just jump over this. Um, I don't know, honestly. I mean, I would... I would just... Oh, wait, I never got that attack. I was thinking, like, Halabastion Part 2. I mean, I... I mean, I'm only doing, like... The first half of End of the World, so like, I don't know, I could just change the name later. Yeah, I call, I mean, okay, technically Holobastion Part 3, but bear in mind, most of the last part was freaking uh, just me, me doing like random crap in the Coliseum, which I didn't really intend on doing, but. I, I consider this the real Hollow Bastion part too, because this is the second visit to Hollow Bastion, so... To me, that, 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 that's why it matters. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I was just crapping around all in Olympus doing the training arc. It definitely paid off, I would say. Also, going on a nice leisurely flight to get over here to the waterway. Yeah, that was an eventful stream. Oh, what's this? No time to get whatever this chest is. Auricalcum, which is a good synthesis material, but I don't really care.
That's right. We were together. You know what's funny? I looked everywhere for you, but you were with me all along. Aww, oh, so fun. Finally, we're together, Kyrie. Now, it's time to get Riku back. You think it'll ever be the same again between us? Riku's lost his... When I turned into a Heartless, you saved me, remember? I was lost in the darkness. I couldn't find my way. As I stumbled through the dark, I started forgetting things. My friends, who I was, the darkness almost swallowed me. But then, I heard a voice. Your voice. You brought me back. I didn't want to just forget about you, Sora. I couldn't. That's it! Our hearts are connected. And the light from our hearts broke through the darkness. I saw that light. I think that's what saved me. No matter how deep the darkness, a light shines within. I guess it's more than just a fairy tale. Well, let's go! You can't go. Why not? Because it's way too dangerous. Come on, Sora. We made it this far by sticking together. You can't go alone. Kairi, even if we're apart, we're not alone anymore, right? I can't help? You'd kind of be in my way. Bruh. Number, first excuse in the series, not let Kyrie do anything, part one, Kappa. <laughs> okay. You gotta be my way. Okay. I love the way they just, like, Take say that. Sit. It's my, it's lucky, my charm. lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Don't worry. My lucky charms. Promise? Promise. Don't ever forget. Wherever you go, I'm always with you. He forgets. Spoiler alert. Why do the cutscenes like this have no voice? Riku, can you hear me? I'll be there soon. I have the other game lane. The one that belongs to this world. I've been trying to get through to you, but the darkness in your heart gets me away. Who are you? What's happened to me? Your heart won the battle against darkness, but it was too late for your body. That's why you're here. In this place of darkness, our hearts are gathered. I like how you think this is somebody serious, but later we just find out it's freaking Mickey Mouse. So what do I do? The door of darkness will open soon, but it's a door we can't enter. It has to be closed from both sides. To do this, you need two keys and two hearts. Maybe you're here for the same reason I am. Maybe it was fate. Fate, huh? You seem to know everything, don't you? Then tell me. Are Sora and Kyrie okay? Don't you feel the echoes of their hearts? You already know the answer. Look inside your own heart. Okay.
forgot that was a shortcut to the magician studying. What the heck? I like how everything's all connected in this town. It's nice. Oh yeah, actually, I could use that as a shortcut to get out of here now. I feel like I end up at Merlin's house a lot. It's a good place to crash and sleep for the night, you know? I want to talk to everyone before I leave. Small house. Also, before I go to Hollow Bash, I actually want to show something off unique that I don't think is in any other world during this point of the game. I go now. Okay. Let's go. Unique dialogue time that's only in Wonderland for some reason, which I assume might have to do with, like, maybe they wanted to add a bunch of dialogue to all the worlds during this part of the game, but they just didn't. As far as I know, it's only in Wonderland. So, let's go to the Queen's Castle and talk to everyone. Yeah, they're just talking about the current events of the world. Like, the. Bruh, Donald is stuck in the car. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> yeah, they're talking about all the darkness stuff, so that's kinda cool. The darkness is nothing to fear! Uh, I mean, I could, I just... I, 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 want, I want to fast travel with the speed of the flight. Pretty cool stuff, though. Oh, I can just do that. Getting this however you're supposed to get it. Also, I found this information on my own, and not while I'm looking at a video, so that's, that's pretty cool. I mean, I guess technically you could say the trial resumes, just not technically here. It, it, more like a data replication of the same world, so yeah, it doesn't change memories. where the Queen of Hearts instead accuses Alice for stealing memories. I'll get the Keyblade later, when I'm treasure collecting, hunting, stuff.
I don't want to get through Hollow Bastion again, though. Because they said there was another route. Okay, hold up. Oh yeah, next. Do you think I'm high enough level to fight these super bosses? I might do that, too. I can't go over there. And how am I supposed to? What? Oh wait, I think I'm supposed to freaking give the gummy to Sid too. I'm kind of. I might not be smart. I made me stupid. This Oath Keeper seems like a good balance between the Olympia. Well, it's not capable of inflicting mighty critical blows, but it is capable of dealing a string of them. So, do you think it would be a good trade-off next? Because, I mean, it does give me one magic point back, and increases the summon power, too. Oh, no deflection? Oh, crap, that's true. Because the Olympia is good at deflecting, so... Hmm, I'll try it. It might be good. I mean, it looks cool. Yeah, definitely. I'll, I'll use that, whatever that is. Oh, yeah, I get the... The rose, or whatever it's called. The thorn. This is like the third time I forgot to talk to Sid. It's like a running gag here. I'm gonna go check out other worlds, just in case there's, like, um, other stuff to, like, talk to. Because I kind of forget if there was other dialogue, but I don't think there is. Let's go visit Jane for no reason. See if she has anything to say about the current darkness pandemic going on across all the worlds. Nope, absolutely nothing. She has no idea what's going on, does she? Man, these these jungle people are so uneducated with the current ongoings of the whole world. As for Agaba, there's literally nobody there. As for Halloween Town, um, probably nobody knows. As for Neverland, nobody is there. Half of these worlds are not populated by anything. That's the sad part. I wish there were people to talk to. 
Oh yeah, this is like the only save point now, because the Ogie's Manor one is gone. So now I'm just stuck in the freaking plaza. Oh, is that new? No, I don't think so. I think they said that before. Wait, where's the mayor? Wasn't he by them? Maybe he moved. Let's see what the professor is up to. Dr. Finkelstein, or Finkelstein, as this game calls him. Yeah, nobody knows anything about anything around here. I don't think these are new either. No! What is even the point of that? Yeah, everyone literally just does the same thing, except for freaking Wonderlands people for some reason. And that's the first world you go to. I feel like it was a scrapped feature, where they were just gonna like do all the worlds, but then they were like, um, let's just do the first world, but then we're like, oh crap, we don't have time. No more dialogue. I don't know. Just a theory. Oh, there's the mayor. Or, uh, yeah, just the same crap. Wasting time is fun. Okay, let's just not do any of that anymore. I'm scared to face these super bosses, so I might wait until, like, I do the Coliseum or something. Wait, how do I get in that warp hole? Normal drive, maybe? No! Okay. Maybe, like, I have to go here. No. Wait, 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 I have an idea. No, I can't drive to the warp hole. Maybe I have to drive to Neverland and then the whole warp hole will be nearby. It didn't let me hover over it. It's just there. Yeah, I want a normal drive to Neverland. It's not letting me go there. that bro okay fine I'll show you that it doesn't work it doesn't it doesn't let me go the portal is just there man there's no option to select it I have to drive to the portal manually. Oh wait, bruh. Traverse Tower? Maybe. I don't know. You would think it would be from Neverland, because that's like the... Oh, bruh. I think it's this warp hole right here. I'll just go this way and then go to Neverland. Also, uh, how is this battle power relevant on... Oh, well I was kind of just skipping the dialogue, so I didn't really... Didn't really read it. Because who cares about what Chip and Dale have to say. They have a crappy movie, man. I'm, I'm still mad about them. So I didn't feel like talking to them now. Like, why, why would you guys do this crappy CGI movie over here? I'm mad. I'm mad at Chippendale right now. I don't want to talk to them or see them at all. <laughs> uh. 
ch 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 Crappy movie. They should have just did a reboot in the vein of like DuckTales or something. That would have been cool. Like the DuckTales show is great, man. They could just do that for like Chippendale and Darkwing Duck or something. And, you know, maybe even Gargoyles. You know, just, just getting that out there. Gargoyles should get a reboot or something that continues it. Like, they have a comic series that continues off from where the show left off. So they could just animate that if they, were, if they felt like it. Ah, uh, so I don't even have to do any of this. I mean, I feel like it anyway, though. It, it looks cool. So I'm just gonna keep doing it. Yeah, I already did the first part, but I wanted I want to do it. Look at how many freaking squares I can kill. That's fun. Honestly, the gummy sections aren't that bad. They're kind of fun. They're just a bit boring at first. sections of Kingdom Hearts 2, I actually had trouble on one of them. Like, the one to, like, the freaking Pride Lands was so hard for some reason. Because there was this, like, boss that would, like, kill you in, like, two hits with a giant laser or something, and I was like, oh, man. You suck. strongest gummy ship at the time and like upgraded it and like gave it a couple like boosters and stuff and called it a day i never built my own ship because I, I was always i mean it seems like it's fun and cool i just didn't really feel like it because like i'd rather just play like the main game than do whatever the game wants me to do with the ship just because you know it, it's it's kind it's time consuming like Maybe if I was more into Legos as a kid, I'd be, like, on top of it, but, like, I don't know. Just never was too interested in building ships. Now 
No, that's quite alright. Peace. Also, can I just teleport to where they are? Yeah, but don't you, don't you want to see people have epic builds, man? Oh, bruh, it only lets me go to Rising Falls. Come on, man. There's no reason I can't go to the other save points. You just want me to go all the way up the castle again for no reason. There's no point to this second visit at all. This is kind of filling me, if I'm honest. Well, I mean, there is a point, but like... Well, at least the heartless are different. There's that. Except they're the same stupid heartless that fly off of the frickin' side of the building and won't let me hit them. Hey, hate those guys. I wanna hit a heartless and it just flies off and then I have to fight it and then die. Gosh darn it, I hate these guys. Good job, Donald. I'm proud of you. 
Show me your worth to the team right now. God damn it! I hate everyone here! <laughs> Won't be as much help to the wizard guys, but I mean, I can use it against large body maybe. Riveting gameplay. Don't you love it when you're knocked off a cliff and you have to go back? You know, I might as well just re go back over here and then heal. Who needs a camping set? Just go back to the safe point, which is right here, which takes a minute. I've never, still never used camping set once in the whole game, man. I don't know why I just have aversion to such items, because I like wasting my time. It's like my favorite thing to do ever in a video game. Waste my time.
Wait, they're gone. Okay, I guess that works. Oof, my bones, oof. That is my reaction. Yeah. 
What the heck? You kidding me? This guy killed me like one hit. I had health. Or at least like a little bit more than like half. Gosh, I hate fighting a bunch of heartless and then the game kills me and I have to restart fighting all the heartless all over again because I want to grind and get levels and nonsense. Like, why do these large bodies do so much damage? Because this large body, I mean, I, I, I get it, the heartless are stronger right now, but like, come on, man. It's a little bit ridiculous what they're doing. God, all these little freaking blue guys are really annoying, actually. Actually sick. Good job, Sim, but I'm proud of you.
Why can't I use Simba again? I just used them. That's weird. Okay, you know what? I hate you. I hate you, propeller guy. Ah! Uh, no, I have to fight all Harley. What up? No, I have to beat them. It's part of my arbitrary goal. To beat every part of Heartless in full game. Any other person would quit here, but like I I am a fighter, I will not I will defeat these guys, man. Satisfying the combo of the large parties.
Oh no. I think that's it. I got him. I have defeated the menace. We have freed the world of the darkness. They are all gone now. No more. I knew I could do it. Also, there is a thing you can get over here. She's supposed to give me an item here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Maybe it's like... Wait, am I supposed to go here? Oh. Uh, okay. someone you were talking about. I think. Yo, that much more strength for only that much freaking power being taken off? I mean, MP? That's just the Olympia, but even better. Except, instead of mighty critical blows, I guess that's a string, but... For that power, it's worth it, man. Look how strong it is. Yo. Oh, also, it doesn't look like the length is very long, but I don't know. Yeah, I just know she gives me good magic upgrade. Because I just remember randomly talking to her and being like, Bro, why is her magic upgrade locked behind an Aerith, which you just randomly find here? Like, seems weird.
Yeah, freaking Kiraga is locked behind Aerith. Like, imagine if I didn't go there and randomly know that there was an NPC in the library in this area, specifically. Like, I would have been locked out of Kiraga. That's crazy. Holy crap, this Keyblade is so much stronger. I can feel the power forcing through my veins. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I kind of forgot to, um, give Donald and Goofy anything. So, should I give him Leaf Bracer? What should I give Donald? What should I give Goofy? Next, what should I give them? Eh. I mean, MP gift seems like it's good because Goofy doesn't really need MP. Oh yeah, second chance. We need Goofy, he's a fighter. Seems good. Okay, what about Dolan? Leaf Bracer? Alright. Maybe cheer? I don't know if that would help Donald, though. Because it only increases the summon MP gauge. Lucky strike? Nah. I mean, maybe, but I don't really care about all that crap anyway. So Leaf Racer seems good for Donald. <laughs> yeah, that is funny. Ugh! 
I hate all these guys. Not this time. Actually, can I just like... No. Oh my god, are you kidding me? verticality and do such a trick. Yeah, that doesn't work. I wanted to try to jump on the ring and then take a shortcut. Actually, I just thought of a big brain to move. I thought he might be able to make it over there because I've heard of people using Dumbo for secret bricks before, but I don't know to what extent he can fly. I was trying to do like an epic trick using Dumbo to fly over there so I could get there faster. Didn't really work out. Donald, why do you keep using Arrow? I don't even want to fight these guys. Oh. Go ahead, restore my HP and MP. Come on! 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 Come on!
How do I make this lift stop move over here? I, wa I want to do stuff with it. I want to fly. I want to get the treasure. Man. Also... Use the other stuff because I don't know if it's a good idea. Um, I was thinking of doing something, but I wasn't sure what. I was gonna use Bambi, but I hit um, Simba by mistake. Oh, might as well use them while I'm here. Give me strength. Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Well, I got what I wanted anyway. Healing. Donald, why are you moving like that? You're like spazzing out. Okay, I did say this second visit was kind of pointless, but at the same time, I think it's kind of cool. Because, like, you feel empowered, you're going with Donald and Goofy now, and you're just trekking back up the castle like a badass, like, storming through the Heartless Fortress. Like, I don't know, it's still kind of cool, even though it's a little retready. It's not as long as the first visit, so it gets a pass to me. Because you're not focused on exploring, you're just focused on killing all the Heartless and getting out of there. Ha! <laughs> 
Mark, Arnold's an MVP right now. He's grown a lot. From his humble beginnings. Soldiers are reminding me of my first humble beginnings in Twilight Town. I mean, Traverse Town. Just like running around, getting killed by them, like in two games. Like that was, that was, those were the days, man. That brings me back. I was getting owned by like literally every enemy ever under the sun. And now look at me, I'm a champ. No, kinda, mostly anyway. I'm still getting over the case in but... Okay, I'm gonna be right back. I have, um, hot dogs. Capo.